please welcome to the Ozone, Trevor Brangley! Super Now well, this man is definitely no stranger to mixed martial arts competition. Trevor Brangley, originally out of South Africa, said his head wasn't on straight for his last fight. He got too relaxed and was winning the fight against Hector Lombard. He got caught, he got dropped, and he admits he got comfortable. He says now his head is on straight. And here's Trevor's keys to victory. He's my trainer partner. I know this guy well. We trained together for many years. He needs to stay sharp mentally, stay focused. He needs to pick his shots, pace himself and pick his shots, and utilize his ground game. He has an unbelievable jiu-jitsu game. He's a great wrestler who's an alternate for the South African Olympic team. And on top, his jiu-jitsu is, uh, put it this way, submit, submit to me a bunch of times, Jeff. Well, you heard it from Phil Baroni first. Well, we know Prangley is the real deal, and he's looking to get back into mixed martial arts action here tonight in the SFL. Now, please welcome to the Ozone in the red corner, Baga Agiv. Baga We talked about Prangley's experience, but Agaya has very, very similar experience. He has youth on his side as well. He has 37 documented fights, and he is only 27 years old. Says he has gained most of his confidence after his fight with Kevin Randleman. And Phil, he told us this, it was either join the circus like his family or get into mixed martial arts. Yeah, and, and, and they told him he has to be in uh, the lion cage <laughs> or the trapeze. He's afraid of heights, and he's allergic to cats, so we took the fighting route. He needs to keep this fight standing. He needs to strike. He needs to avoid the takedown. Believe me, you don't want Trevor Prangley on top of you. And he needs to trust Prang Prangley's will. Prangley has been on a little bit of a losing streak, and, and losing is contagious. So he needs to test his will. I'm rooting for the old guy, though, Jeff. There's no, there's no secret. Either way, we're set for a very, very evenly matched competition here. As Baga Agaev gets a final inspection from Uche Shimada. Here is the tale of the tape. We spoke about it. A definite age advantage for Agaev. Both of them identical in weight. A height and reach advantage goes to Trevor Prangley, and both of them roughly the same amount of mixed martial arts fights. And we go up to Udom Tacker for the introductions. This bout is scheduled for three rounds of five minutes each. In the blue corner, he weighed in at 94.4 kilos. His style is wrestling and MMA. His record, 23 wins and nine losses. From Coeur d'Alene, Idaho, representing Trevor Prangley, AKA. Please welcome Trevor Prangley. In the red corner, his official weight, 93 kilos. His style, judo and MMA. His record, 26 wins, 11 losses. Representing Rus fighters from St. Petersburg, Russia. Please welcome Baga Oge. Referee for this fight, Mark Goddard. Both fighters in position. A look of intensity on both their okay, faces. You ready? You ready? Let's do this. Here we go. And I could kind of consider this a main event. I mean, these guys very, very well seasoned at their craft. Prangley's a warrior. He's been in there with the best in the world in every big organization, and he throws a hard one, too. I mean, Prangley throws those bombs. He, he just. Oh, yeah, with the spinning back kick. Somebody was trying to get a, oh, Prangley's head snapped back. I'm not sure what hit him right there. I'll get his head. <laughs> I'll get him with the low kick. Trevor getting comfortable. Trevor needs to be first. He can't wait here. He needs to be first. He's trying to get loose. I'll get oh. 
Oh. Going to the body. Hard kick to the Spin body. Spin back kick. Reminiscent of uh, Shlaminko. Trevor Prentley needs to get go forward, dictate the fight, push push the pace, get not give his face, not let him load up that spinning back kick again. Yeah, Gaev's wife, I'm told, has a three and MMA record. She just gave birth, and uh, she's a Gaev's pad holder. I mean, <laughs> that is a tough family there. Prangley also trained at home for this this fight. Low kick by Agiev. Another low kick. Prangley checked that second one. Prangley is having a little trouble getting loose. It's a little tight. He's going to put that chin down and let go. It's a little hesitant. He's inching his way in. There he goes. Double left hook. Nice. Nice take down defensive by Prangley. Yeah, guy, I've, I'm not sure if uh, Prangley is going to be an easy guy to take down. No, he's definitely not. I, I've sparred and wrestled with this guy many times. He's super strong, and super hard to get off, off his feet. Tabaga, a guy has defense. He is a good wrestler. He competes at a very, very high level. And he's a, oh! Spinning back fist. Prangley has a beard, though. That landed flush. Didn't even budge Prangley. Prangley needs to get going. He needs to let his hands go. Counting right now. Good job by Prangley. He needs to keep going, though. He needs to get his pace going. Agiev is uh, dictating the pace. Good job by Prangley. He should get this fight to the ground. Agiev seems to want to land that spinning back kick. That's his go-to move tonight. Yeah, Agiev, he's also a clothing retailer. So if you shoplift from his clothing store, you better watch out. You can get spinning back kick right in the guts. <laughs> Inching in with that low kick. Yeah, I agree with you, Phil. Prangley needs to get on his game. Nice knee to the body. Prangley should maintain that clinch position. Here it comes. Yeah, I'm telling you right now, I can send the spin back kick coming again. Nice leg kick by Prangley. There it is. Caught on the elbow of uh, Prangley. Prangley starting to detect and deflect. And that's the Achilles heel of uh, Trevor Prangley, the body shot a little bit. So I'll give him watch some tapes. Nice body shot of his own there, though. One of the good body take that. Playing the wipe in his face, maybe a little scratch or a poke. A minute and a half left in round one of a potential three. And both men waiting for the other to make a move, I think. This guy's a little hesitant. Looks like Prangley may have caught one to the mouth. Yeah, I think it was a, I think it was a scratch, finger in the eye. Another left by, by a guy of. Prangley's cut, he's bleeding. Nice body shot by Prangley. I can't right tell where, eye. I can't tell where he's cut. I mean, maybe the nose or the mouth. I think it's a cut yeah, it's on the, the side of the nose. Yeah, he wiped the nose there. It's over the nose, maybe. Yeah, it is. It's, it looks like it could be streaming from above his left eye. Nice leg kick by Prangley. He landed that twice. That's open for him. Agiev comes with the right hand. Oh. Nice left hook right hand by Prangley. Prangley slips that jab and lands a nice hard right to the body. Oh. Agiev with a spin and back fist. Prangley eats it and smiles. He snapped his head with that spinning back fist. <laughs> Came out with a look at that smile. Prangley just smiling at him. It's gonna take more than that to hurt me. Nice uppercut by Prangley. Nice, another rip in the right hand. Overhand right by Prangley. Back and I'll give up. I give with a straight left. Stop. Straight right on the button. Good round, tough round. Yeah, tough, tough round. Prangley kind of poured it on at the last minute. Looking a little worse for wear, but it's just a cut it's over the a, left eye. It, I think it's like a fingernail, like a thumbnail right, right, right above the eye there. It won't be a problem, it just looks bad. Put some grease in our baby, let him go. How would you score that one? I mean, uh, Brangley started off slow and ended big. Yeah, I mean, it was a real tough round to score. The, the blood's gonna make it look worse for Brangley, but, but I think he stole that round. He definitely dictated the pace at the end. 
A capacity crowd here tonight in Delhi, India, as I'm sitting with a shirtless New York badass Phil Baroni. 12,500 plus. <laughs> as we are prepared for round number two, very evenly matched thus far. Prangley started to come alive towards the end of round number one as Baga Agaev. Both guys touch, shake hands. Prangley in the blue, Agaev in the red. Prangley looks a little loose and lands a nice right to the body. Fake spin back kick. Yeah, Prangley. Prangley detected, check that kick, come back with a hard right hand, it's spin back kick again. Yeah, he's okay. definitely, Prangley's getting it now. He's hurt, turning his body, turning his hip. Oh. Nice body shot by Prangley. You want to go to my body, I'll go to your body. Now, a guy of backing up a little bit. Yeah, Prangley now is dictating pace, and taking a breather. Both of them fighting at a very, very slow reactive pace. Excuse nice me. Nice body shot again by Prangley. Big right hand to the body. Oh. Body kick by Agia. He's first, he's trying to be first. Hey, are you allowed to shout shout advice, Baroni? Come on. <laughs> Someone tried to get a USA chant going back there. It didn't go over too well. You guys are sounding like me. <laughs> nice overhand right there. Slips under that. Prangley willing to fight this guy standing up. Nice check of the leg kick by Prangley. He sees it coming now. I think Prangley's got a beat on I got him. Yeah, guy breathing heavy, heavy out of the mouth. Nice right uppercut by Prangley to the body. Guy have lands one and it's Prangley giving one back, so. Nice jab, right hand. Oh, oh nice uppercut. And here's the right hand. Definitely got that guy up's attention. 40 years young is Trevor Prangley. Eats an uppercut. Eats a left hand by Agiev. Yeah, Trevor's getting caught a lot with his with his hands down by a guy of Agiev looks a little fresher. A very, very slow, methodical pace to this match. It's Prangley's. Oh, nice deep. Right hand by Prangley, but that was a hard leg kick. Deep leg kick when you when you can feel the bottom of the cage thud. Nice left hook right hand by Prangley. Ooh, good exchange by both guys. I'll give Lint an inside uppercut there. Prangley back and I'll give up. Prangley Halfway through. Jab. We're halfway through the second round, Phil, and uh, very competitive fight here. Very much so. It's uh, Baga Gaev. Oh, oh, nice, nice combination by Franklin. Another one. He's got to push forward here. Not, not, not as much steam on that kick by kick by Agiev. Agiev in, in the ropes. Good uppercut. Oh, nice knee to the head by Franklin. I've eaten those Franklin uppercuts. They don't tickle. <laughs> Both guys just flat-footed. Look like someone you could take a picture. Oh, like, nice right hand by Franklin. Look like if they posed for a picture for about a second. I'm not. And, Oh, I'll get up with the spin back fist. Prangley slips it. Prangley looking good here. I like to see Prangley throw a kick. Prangley has good kicks. Nice uppercut by Prangley. I'll get beaten to the punch. There's a one two by Prangley. Nice uppercut. Nice combination. I'll get up in a little bit of trouble. I don't think he expected this from Prangley. Prangley pushing the pace a little bit now. Inching his way in. Right hand. Knee to the head. Nice combination by Prangley. Stealing this round from Agia. One thing you notice, a, a guy have sort of dictated that pace of the first round. Now he's, he's putting his back against the cage a lot more. Prangley takes a big deep breath there. He's got to bite down and keep going. He can't show that type of fatigue. Oh, just missed with the right hand. Good one, too. Agia doesn't seem to want to exchange anymore. Oh, nice. Nice combination by Prangley. I have doing, doing a great job of deflecting. Deflecting don't win your rounds, though. He's got a, he's got a punch. It's not a deflecting contest. Nice jab, though, by Agiev. Oh, the spinning back fist. Agiev throws devastating, devastating stuff, though. Prangley's got to stay awake. Nice 
jab. Jab. I gave on the fence. Oh, just misses the home run. I gave slip underneath that. I don't mind a methodical fight like this when a fight is slow at this pace, but both guys are working and picking their shots. Oh, they're throwing hard stuff. I mean, it's a good fight. It's not a bomb burner, but it's definitely a good tactical fight. Prang was looking to steal this round. Nice to the body. Nice combination. No. I think Prang stole that round. And he may have done it. Like you said, Phil, Prangley took some heavy shots in the first round. It, it was that one thumb above the eyebrow. I seen it early. That one thumb that's just making Prang look worse for the wear. Yeah, it, you know, back in the old days of MMA, people kind of took that as damage. It's not really damage. It's just blood. Put Everyone. some grease on it. Everyone has bled at some point. Talk about bleeding. Let's see here. Prangley reaching in with a nice uppercut. Just misses with that right hand. Back and I'll give up. Right here again. Nice uppercut. Right hand to the body. Just barely missing that right hand. A la John Jones. Instead of the elbow, he threw the uppercut. You know, reaching in and touching hands. That's a little Muay Thai technique. See it? Boom. With the uppercut there. Nice job by Prangley. That was a good round, man. That, that first round was hard to call. I got to give Prangley the second round. We may be even here. This could be the deciding round. Oh, it, and like I said, the, the pace of this fight is sort of methodical. But, 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 you, it's, but it's a hard pace. Yeah, you it's know. A controlled hard pace. You know something big is going to happen in the third round. I'm just feeling that, that the, these guys are kind of saving it in reserve for the last minute. I'll give a kick to the liver there. Left kick to the liver. I'll give still goes trying to go to the body. Take something away from Prangley. Good check by Prangley. Prangley reading the kicks a lot better now. He's got him where he wants him against the fence. He's got to let him go. Nice knee to the head. I'll give Lucky at his hands up there. I'll give hard to penetrate. He has good defense. He definitely does. That was Prangley with a leg kick. Yeah, he's got good kicks. Hard right kick, man. He needs to throw more. Prangley on his bike a little bit. Ooh, over the hand, overhand right by Agiev. And a left hook by Agiev. Prangley can't wait. He's pulling with that job. He's got to go. He can't wait. He's very comfortable right now. Nice left hook. Agiev goes for the takedown. Prangley. Yeah. Agayev is definitely starting to look a little tired here. Nice one-two by Prangley. Right in front of us, Jeff. That was a hard one-two, and there's the jab. Agayev trying to inch forward. Agayev knows he needs to come back with something here. And, and Prangley, at 40 years old, he told me the other day he knows, you know, he wants to come back Man, I told and, Prangley and make before, an impact. I told Prangley before this fight he has an opportunity here in the SFL, and he looks like he took, he took my advice seriously. See him smiling, taking that body kick. Definitely prepare for this fight well. Prangley smiling just moments ago after taking the body kick. Look how close nice they are. They're Agiev. close. They swung for the fences with that. If, if one of those hit. Oh, hit. oh, Prangley, nice knee. That I think landed. Agiev got a beard. That Russian guy could take a shot. It looked like uh, Prangley wanted to move forward. He stepped in a puddle of sweat and backed off. It's one thing, oh, the double jab. Prangley's not capitalizing when oh, he... Oh, oh, it's out! A right hand on the butt! It's over! Stop the fight! He's, he's, he's done! <laughs> right hand by Prangley, the towel comes firing. Unbelievable! What a win! Big right hand on the butt! Sounded like somebody's clocked a gong with a hammer. Gong show time tonight. Just as I said, Bill. I was waiting for that one big shot here in the third round. I thought they were saving it. Prangley landed it. Big right hand on the button. Bong! And it's over. And once again, great sportsmanship as always in mixed martial arts. <laughs> That's my man. That's my buddy right there. And, and, and the crazy thing about that kid is he can make 185 pounds. Look, there it was, right hand. Hockey is out. Referee gives him, gives him the benefit of the doubt, but he's done. Nice right hand there by Prangley. I've ate those before. Oh! It's over. Frankly, the nice guy gives the referee the opportunity to stop it. You don't want to stop it, I'm going to smash his head. They throw in the towel. A little bit too late. Oh, big right hand. Look at that. Big one. I'm coming. 
Langley over here smiling at us. Very energetic, Phil. That woke you up tonight, definitely. I'm, I'm stoked, dude. I, that guy needed that win, and, that, and he got it. I mean, okay, five, ten, boom, five, exclamation five, point on that win. I, he needed it, and he got it. I'm, I'm really proud of him. I'm really happy for him. Aga Agayev, guy. he definitely gave it to Prangley. Agayev is super tough, super tough guy. Be Kevin Randleman, man. I'm, I'm my teammate. We go after Udom Tacker for the decision. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner by technical knockout in two minutes, three seconds of round three from South Africa, blue corner, Trevor Brangley! That man has come a very, very long way since his first fight in a 12 foot by 12 foot dog kennel. That is the old school days of mixed martial arts when you're fighting in a 12, 12 by 12 dog cage. 